They had this Hello Fall mat, and they also had another one which I shared in a little reel. Only ten dollars, so that's not a bad buy at all. Rest tea, Pepsi, Gatorade. We got some pancakes, another thing of pizza, Ice Krispie treats. They finally had some beef patties this time, some bacon. This Bark Thins Snacky Chalk. I don't know if you guys had this before, but this should be healthy, a healthy go-to snack. And then, I don't know if I showed you guys the cookies already, the mixed cookies we got last time. So we saw these macaroons and wanted to get them. Um, some protein bars, the Rayo's Alfredo sauce, and then the pack of um, ketchup with the sweet relish and mustard. So that's it. That just basically is a quick midweek pickup. I had to get a few things, so I decided to go there. And then I'll still go to either Publix or Walmart to get some other things later. Like more of my produce, maybe like some uh, salad. And then also I wanted to get some, possibly get some grapes and those type of things. But that's it for this little grocery haul. Okay, guys, I just got back from doing a pickup with uh, Publix. I had to go pick up some food from Panda Express. And then also I went to Home Depot, which you guys would have already seen that in my previous video. Because I did a little uh, outdoor patio update. So definitely check that video out if you missed that one. I'm going to just go over this quick Publix grocery haul. As I said, this is just to add into what we usually get for the week when things are going down. So today's Publix. The other day I showed you guys Costco. Okay. Bagels. Mexican cheese. Parmesan cheese. Some grapes. A salad kit. Cheese. Mason just got his haircut <laughs> refreshed. <laughs> yeah, and I got some scallions, vanilla waffer, wa uh, wafers, I don't know why I said wafers, cheese it some know. fruit cups, I'm starting to get stuff at school, meat lovers, these are actually easier for me sometimes in the morning with working and trying to get Jay his, hold on Mason, trying to get Jay his food, um, trying to make sure he gets protein and that type of stuff, so I give him these and then I may get paired with like a waffle or a bagel or something like that, okay. then some broccoli and then you got, um, saw these so pick these up they look kind of good got the water for some after school these. lemonades i got bread they were supposed to give me hot dog buns but it gave me hamburger but that's fine we do have some hamburger in the freezer some raisin bread some rolled oats the creamy jiffy peanut butter honey i'm going to be making something with this to share with you guys so stay tuned for that some more syrup tea bags the thin spaghettis with the hidden veggies if you have kids or family members that don't want to eat their vegetables this is definitely a good way to give them the serving of vegetables with their meals and then last some more frozen stuff over here hot pockets i wanted to try this out that looks really good to serve with some chicken or something on the side cheddar potatoes pick up a couple of these the salmon i thought it actually was more than just two in a pack the fillets were only two but i picked that up Waffles, these sister Schubert buns, and a pack of ground beef. This is my dinner from Panda Express. So me and Zoe, <laughs> we are in the uh, veterinarian's office. We had to take Max to the doctor because he's been having like a cough. So I wanted to make sure it's not a kennel cough. I did buy him the homeo uh, drops that I've been giving to him for like a couple of days now, but I just want to make sure because he's an older dog. I brought him in here for him to get a checkup and all that stuff. So I'll let you guys know what's going on with that once they come back in. Why are you back there growling them dolls, Max? Hey. But, um, cool. Me and Sonara's side of JCPenney's where her getting our hair done. Um, 
I'll show you guys how everything looks like a little vlog. Morning. 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 Guys, um, it is a new day. I didn't get to vlog with you guys yesterday after I came back from the vet with Max. Basically, it's like a respiratory type of respiratory infection he has. So they gave him some pills to take. Uh, he has to take them twice a day. So we're doing that. And other than that, his heart sounds good, lungs and all that stuff. So he's fine. Uh, me and Sanaya went to the hairdresser earlier. I think I might have showed you guys a little clip of us sitting there. I didn't do too much vlogging in there. It was really busy and just a little flabbergasted in there. It is so hot outside. When I got back in the car from getting our hair done, it said 108. So, yeah. Like, why did I straighten my hair? But usually I do this around the time of my birthday. He makes it back there sleeping. I'm back in his room. Last night I came in here and I basically wiped down his shelves and stuff and put stuff back how it's supposed to be. Right now I'm going to go through his bins in his closet. I'm going to take out all the clothes that's too small and the school clothes that are too small. Put them to the side and I'm going to hang up all the new uniforms and stuff that I got him. Um, I also got all of them some shoes from DSW. I got him these right here from DSW. Just sharing some of the stuff that I got for them. Um, and I'll show you what the girls got. Clothes here in his room. I actually have some nice clothes in here too that I need to go in there and hang up. Uh, I ordered her and Zoe some stuff from Forever 21. And then I have stuff that I'm getting from H&M and also... Um, H&M, I did Forever 21 already, and then Hollister. So that's what we're starting off with for the school. And then, you know, as we get further into school, I'll get some more stuff as needed. Zoe and Sanaya are in regular clothes now. Sanaya's been in regular clothes, but Zoe's in regular clothes. And then she's growing so quick and fast, so I definitely had to get her some new stuff. She purged her stuff as well and been basically cleaning out her closet. She's old enough to do that. So I'm going to just take you guys along with me just putting up Mason's clothes, purging his closet, and then I will go in front and show you the other shoes that I got for them. And um, also I got a basket from Target, a new basket for my blankets out there. I've been wanting to do it for a minute now. I wanted a very big basket. The one I've been wanting is a lot of money. So I saw this one, which is still expensive in a sense, if you don't want to pay that much for it. I think I paid $45 for it. From Target but it's a big basket and it's better than the one I have out there to keep our blankets in there so I'm going to basically just change that out I was trying to wait till I refreshed it but it needs to be done now so we're going to take care of that and I think I have a other few new items I can show you guys too that I got from Amazon some home stuff to show you and then also I'll show you guys we're going to make some basically some protein uh, power balls with this new protein powder that I got and I'm going to share it with you guys in a little bit. I told you every single time, don't you worry. You would always call me at the wrong time. So you can know what I was up to. Oh, don't you get that? It's just stupid. I got French toast and Izod. I got the t-shirts. These are all from Amazon. I have them in my Amazon store. 
I got uh, French toast. I've bought these before. Very good material. So he has basically, I got him some white ones. He has the blue ones. And then I also bought him the uh, children's place. This sweater looks really nice. Good material. It's a really cute sweater. So I got him this because he had the Abercrombie one, but that got too small. So he has this one now for school. And then the pants are French toast and also Izod. So that's what I got for school pants for him. And these are the ones from... Um, so that's that I'm gonna get these hung up I probably will be ironing clothes um, sometime during the week I'm not gonna do it right now because I'm gonna take up too much time and I have other stuff I need to do but yeah I'm gonna be ironing clothes and then the girls real quick this is Sanaya's stuff I'm gonna show you really quick I got her this shirt from Forever 21 so she got that shirt um, this t-shirt here Zoe already put her clothes up, and she's been putting clothes up, so. And she has this shirt here. These pants, like cargo pants. If you can see them. These cargos right here. And then these, like, uh clear tight same material on it so the like ribbed flare tights so yeah It, this is everything that I took out school clothes some things a couple things are garbage the rest I'm gonna donate some shoes and this is how his closet is looking um, I'm going to actually take these out and iron them tomorrow I don't feel like doing it right now but everything is hung up I cleared out all that stuff there his bins are neat everything is where they are supposed to be I needed to vacuum but being that he's sleeping I'm not gonna do that right now I'm gonna bag these clothes up and then I'm gonna go in the front Get that basket together that I was telling you guys about and show you a few things out there. And then I'm going to make some protein bars with you guys. I got her hair Another video, guys, is sponsored by Earth Chimp Organic Vegan Protein Shake. I'm going to be sharing this with you guys. It is a healthy uh, protein powder that you guys can use. It's plant-based. You can use this in your shakes. You can use this in your smoothies. You can mix it with milk, water. For me, I'm going to be making a protein ball uh, treat with you guys, a snack. So not just using it in your drinks, you guys can use this in your foods. If you're making like cookies or anything, you can actually add this to your food to give it that protein that you need and to make it a little bit more healthier. Also, when you purchase it on the back of it, it does let you know that they donate 10% of your package towards removing discharged plastics from the ocean. So that's good that they're looking out for the environment. This is also... Um, made in Ireland by a small company so it is you're supporting basically um, small businesses out there and you see that it's gluten-free no sugar no salt no dairy soy gums gluten ethyl if I said that properly and then no GMOs so definitely go online and support them I did leave a link below so you guys can check it out I have the chocolate flavor they do have the vanilla as well and I also have the one that is unsweetened so I'm going to show you guys the protein treat that I'm going to make right now. And for that, we're going to use a protein powder. We're going to need some peanut butter, rolled oats, honey, salt, and some chocolate chips.
So once everything's been mixed together, this is how it looks. And now we're gonna scoop them together and add them on the parchment paper in the fridge for an hour. I just took these out the fridge, sorry about the noise. Um, they actually taste very good. Zoe had one, Jay tasted it, or she had two. Jay tasted it, he liked them, um, and then Sanai tasted it. So very good. I don't taste any of the like appetites or anything like that from the protein bar. Really quick, I'm going to show you guys this basket, and then I'm going to put these blankets in the basket with you guys so you can see the difference that it's gonna make as far as me getting this big round one this is the basket that i got from target and they actually had a nice sale going on i picked up a couple of vases and i put them back because the ones i want um from crate and barrel and a couple other places i'm just going to save for to get the ones that i really want um instead of just having a whole bunch of knickknacks here and there but this is a threshold brand and you guys can see that it is huge so I'm hoping that this is going to house all of, sorry about all this mess, but house all of these blankets here. These are the kids' book bags. Mason's is in the bedroom. Zoe got this um, Jan Sport. She got a new one. She was going to use the other one, but she wanted a new one. And then I got this one for Sanaya. We also got some free um, book bags. So I'll probably end up doing some kind of giveaway or something at some point for some kids that are in need for some backpacks and school goods. If not this year, then I'll keep them for um, next year. And then these are my shoes that I got. I was gonna get some night a pair of these, but they didn't have her size. So I got these for myself, Steve Madden. I think they're really cute. I don't know what this little thing is right here on the front of them, but these are those. So I can't wait to rock those. Here I have some fall stuff, some florals. I had these for a little while um, sitting over here. I'm gonna do the kitchen for the um, bars. I have that and then I have this book, which is really nice, called Arranging Things by Colin King. A nice size book, nice color, all that good stuff. So I have that there. And then here I have a lamp warmer, which I'll show that with you guys when I do the little reveal or something maybe I'll try to open it with you guys we'll see but these are the shoes I got for the kids these are Zoe's she got some Reeboks so I was trying to show you guys really quick because I said I was going to show you and then these are Sanaya's which I think I got them too big I'm going to try them on her again just to see but these are her new balance she fits them but I think I could go down the size if I wanted to but these are really cute so I got those for her
obsessing over dress when I split. Shoot me a blink. I'm dying from boredom. I even lie when I tell the truth. Honestly, what's the use? They say you have to be beaten up before you're tender enough. They say. So I think this is base is definitely a lot better than the other one and it still can hold a little bit more if I needed it to, if I needed to roll them up more. This I'll figure out somewhere else to put this at.